Hey everyone, it's Baby Bear, and I wanted to show you guys this new update to the stockpile event. And I have learned that when something is too good to be true, I should not be sharing this on video because we never know if it's actually intentional with Ebony, but I do think that this is legitimate. So I wanted to share it with you, but it is something that I have not seen people talk about much. So they have changed this where they are giving you 60 million resources for a $4.99 pack. Now, 60 million resources means you're getting 240 actual resources. That's that's not normal, right? That's like something that they normally don't do. And the same thing, if, if I wanted to buy an extra $10 pack, that's 400 million resources that you're getting for $9.99. What is going on, right? For, I would say, a little under 40 bucks, you would be getting 300 times 4, which I believe is 1.2 billion. So they are trying to incentivize you guys to buy during non-event days. Now, you might be saying to yourself, you know, I don't need these resources because I have my family that helps me with resources or my alliance. And... I will say that it's not only just the resources and this is why I think this is this is intentional is because this only gives you safe resources. So you cannot take advantage of this with your family. You can't take advantage of it with other accounts. It's only for your main account that you would be using on your own castle. So that's why I do think it's intentional and that's why I am sharing this because you know, I know people are like, oh, that did look like a really good idea and until they saw that. So for All Stars, this is the pack that they sell during the non-event days. It's pretty much essential if you don't have healing speeds. You're getting 750 healing speeds times three days, and then you can double coupon it. So that's quite an extraordinary amount of heal speeds that you can get and not have to dig into your common speeds. So I would advise getting a pack like this. And, you know, with 150 March speeds, you can double keep on that and get 300. So just think that you're getting to get this pack. And then you saw the amount of resources that you would get if you spent $99. So I think that is a really good deal. And I think it's... I, like, I don't want to jinx it, but for me, like for somebody like me that doesn't have family members and, and things like that, this would be amazing for me. So I wanted to alert you guys to that. But here's where this is really cool as well. So they have these stockpile tickets that don't expire. And so you can redeem for all these like little rewards. But what's most important is that chest out there. So when you open that chest you're going to find some really good duty generals and subsidy generals. Now, I know the realistic expectations of trying to do this as a low coiner is going to be hard to get 1,300 tickets in order to get this. But for people that are coining, you are able to basically get a good chance at using a duty general or a subsidy general that you actually will use. So while we tend to spend like $99 on the Trial of Knights packs in order to get those chances of good generals, this is kind of like, since you're already spending, this is just stockpiling. So it's like passive. It's like passive tokens that you can eventually open after around three rounds. So this offers you $400 worth of extra benefits, right? When you add up all of the tickets, it gives you 510 tickets. So for 1300 for 1300 tickets, you're going to need to do this like three times. Oh, maybe a little less than the third time, but it's about three times. So if you're already spending and if you're already like trying to stockpile on the the battle packs, then you're going to get like a little nice bonus. So obviously, if you're free to play, 
you're only getting, I think, one stockpile ticket a day. And I think that's what, three days. So that's going to take you a really, really, really long time to save up for, for free. I think that's what, 1300 divided by three. I don't know, guys, I'm really bad at math. It's like 400 something days. So I would say being realistic, this is definitely still, even though these are giving you nice prizes, it's definitely for the coiners. And, you know, I, I guess if you're a free player, you don't need to save up for that chest. You can just, you know, redeem it for other items in that stockpile thing. So for me, I just wanted to point this out to you guys, especially because, look, I know how people are with just spending during event days, but I do think that because of All Stars is coming, just get your heal speeds and get extra rewards from it, especially those blood crystals. So that's it. That's all I have to say. Obviously, I'm going to say use Aptoid, use my friend Kevy's code and save some money. And I will see you guys on Saturday. And hopefully I'm going to have enough heal speeds. I'm a little worried, but I don't know. We're going to stock up. All right. Talk to you guys later. Bye.